Okay, this is a review for U.S. History 2 final, first column. So we're going to start at the bottom and move up. First word is Angel Island. Angel Island. Most immigrants who entered the United States at Angel Island were from China. Most immigrants that entered the United States from China came through Angel Island. <clears throat> 17th Amendment. 17th Amendment placed a selection of senator candidates directly in the hands of the voters. 17th Amendment placed the selection of senatorial candidates directly in the hands of the voters. Homestead Act. Homestead Act gave 160 acres to anyone willing to live on the land for five years. Gave 160 acres to anyone willing to live on the land for five years. Social Darwinism. Social Darwinism is wealth is the measure of a person's strength and value to society. That idea that if somebody has wealth or power then um, it's they're more valuable to society so social darwinism wealth is a measure of one's value to society <clears throat> black codes black codes limited the rights of freed african americans black codes limited the rights of freed African Americans. Farmers in the 1920s. Farmers in the 1920s had growing debt and falling farm prices. Farmers in the 1920s had growing debt and falling farm prices. Bull market. You just need to know what that is. It is a period of rising stock prices when the money is going up and up and up in the stock market. Henry Ford changed working conditions for his employees, increased wages, and gave weekends off. Henry Ford changed working conditions for his employees increased wages and gave them weekends off. Back to normalcy. Warren Harding's presidential campaign slogan. Back to normalcy. Warren Harding's presidential campaign slogan. Irreconcilables. Irreconcilables Utterly oppose the creation of the League of Nations. Irreconcilables. Utterly oppose the creation of the League of Nations. Conscientious objectors. You just need to know what they are. Conscientious objectors <clears throat> were people who rejected military service due to religious or moral beliefs. Mexicans during World War I. Most Mexicans migrated to the western United States to work on farms and ranches because of the labor shortage from the war. So, Mexican Americans migrated to western United States to work on farms and ranches. Espionage Act. The Espionage Act Compromise freedom of the press by banning seditious texts. Espionage Act. Compromise freedom of the press by banning seditious texts. <clears throat> pull, fa pull factors of the Great Migration. You just need to know some of the pull factors or what was a pull factor. Um, and most of those being jobs, and 
um, better lives in the North. Machine guns. Machine guns gave a tactical advantage to defensive forces. Machine guns gave a tactical advantage to defensive forces. <clears throat> Number 13 here, Jungle. Jungle was written by Upton Sinclair, and he wrote about meatpacking industries. The Jungle was written by Upton Sinclair, and he wrote about meatpacking industries. Tenure of Office Act. Congress impeached, impeached Johnson for violating this law. Tenure of Office Act. Congress impeached impeached Johnson by violate, for violating this law. Immigration, reasons and geography. Reason for um, immigration, it was needed for labor. So they needed immigration to provide um, the needed labor. And there's also a question on immigration that deals with where they lived. So immigrants typically lived in cities and the reason for that is that's where jobs were. So it was easier for them to live in cities. Battle of Gettysburg. It took place on Union soil and it was the last major battle on Union soil, it was the turning point of the war. Battle of Gettysburg, it took place on Union soil, it was the turning point of the war. I think there's two questions over the Battle of Gettysburg. Northern industry, this focuses on the Civil War as far as the North. Northern industry was advanced and industrialized during the Civil War. Northern industry was advanced and industrialized during the Civil War and after the Civil War too. Willamot Proviso. Willamot Proviso sought to restrict the expansion of slavery. Willamot Proviso sought to restrict the expansion of slavery. Tenant farming. It is the most independent farming arrangement in the South. Sharecropping. It is the most dependent farming arrangement, um, but also landowners inflated their expense costs to make more money off the sharecroppers. Ida B. Wells spoke out against lynching. Radical Republicans. They sought harsh punishments for the Confederate States or former Confederate States because they believed slavery was a crime. Radical Republicans. They sought harsh punishments against former Confederate States because they believe that slavery was a crime. Fort Sumter. Fort Sumter was seen by the North as the first act of war. Republican Party. This deals primarily with the Republican Party in the Civil War. It was the party that was against slavery and its expansion. Republican Party. So this is the Civil War focus here. It was against slavery and ex its expansion. And that is column one of U.S. History 2 final.